All year long, we've talked about how good the Carthage Bulldogs are. The undefeated season, the top running back in the state, the championship pedigree. Bottom line, there are good teams, there are great teams, and then there's the Carthage Bulldogs. To Arlington we go. Carthage against Kennedale in the 4A state championship game. This one was all Bulldogs opening drive. Bulldogs get the party started. Hey, hey, hey. Gunner Caps hits DeWayland Ingram for the touchdown. They gave Carthage an early 7-0 lead. Next drive for the Bulldogs, and Gunner Caps at it again. This time he goes deep, and like a good neighbor, Makai Colbert is there. The 64-yard touchdown pass gave Carthage a quick 14-0 lead. Kennedy would cut that lead in half, but it was all Bulldogs from there late in the first half. Of course, no Carthage highlights are complete without that guy right there, Mr. Keonta Ingram. The Texas commit goes 41 yards for the touchdown. That put the Bulldogs up 28-7 to intermission to the third quarter, and the Gunner Caps air show continues. Look at that Eww. right in the hands of D Bowens for the 76 yard touchdown. Caps was named the offensive MVP in the game for obvious reasons. Bulldogs up 35 to 7 at this point to the fourth quarter. Keonta Ingram with the exclamation point. Mama, there goes that man. Another play to add to his highlight reel, 65-yard touchdown. Ingram ran for 163 yards, three touchdowns on the afternoon, and Carthage goes on to spank Kennedale 49-21. For more on this dominant victory, here's sports director Keith Leventhal. It was a dominating performance by the Bulldogs. They put up almost 600 yards of offense, scored on their first seven possessions, and really never gave Kennedale a chance. It's the sixth state title in the last 10 years for Carthage, and this one was special. It's amazing, man. It really is. You know, it never gets old. To go through this, you know, with a team like this, you know, a team that you've been growing up with, you know, since we was little, you know, um, it means a lot. It's been a dream since we were little. And we made it come true. I, I can't explain to you how, how it feels right now. It means a lot because like, we family and like it just means a lot. It just stays with us and we're a group of guys that we just love each other. These guys behind me, especially these seniors, they wasn't going to let anybody lose focus, not during practice, not uh, in the game or anything. Special group. Despite all of their success in recent years, the Bulldogs still feel the pressure when it comes to bringing home another title. We relish the pressure because that's where our program is. It's always a lot of pressure being being in this program at Carthage with the expectations we have from the community and, and the people around the state. This Carthage, the pressure will always be on you. Now we got pressure to go to college and make some of ourselves. Coming over, our junior high coordinator said you're going to get at least two championships out of this group. They finished up right, and uh, I love them, and I'm just so proud of them. Three, two, one, go! The Bulldogs will lose a substantial amount of talent from this team, including Keontae and DeWaylon Ingram, but they bring back quarterback Gunner Caps, so it's very possible we'll be back here next year for a run at a third straight state title. At AT&T Stadium, Keith Leventhal, CBS 19 Sports. Thank you, Keith. I have a good feeling they're going to go for the three-peat as well. Also, big ups to Coaster Rat. That is six championships in ten years, which is wow. just ridiculous. Those highlights Holy are lit. Cow. Well, thank you, Tashara. Yeah. You are lit. Oh, please. <laughs>